One word from God can change your life. That's why I've stepped out in the prophetic. My name is Kevin Bridges, and you're listening to Daily Prophetic. I see someone sitting on a bench, being still and reading the word. The Lord says to you, spend time with me. Spend time in my word this day, allowing it to permeate your mind, allowing it to change your mind. Trust in me and trust that I am renewing you. I'm strengthening you. I'm giving you a foundation of hope, a foundation of truth. As you meditate upon my word, I will renew you and I will change you from the inside out. Make my word your home. Take time even just a little, take time in my word, allowing my word to change you, allowing my word to bring you to a place of freedom. I see someone who is lifting weights, and when they begin, they can just lift a small amount. But as time progresses, week after week, they can carry more weight, they can use more strength. The Lord says to you, I'm leading you through a process of strengthening. I'm leading you to a place of greater strength in the spirit. Watch and see, for that which I have done already, the process through which I've taken you, has strengthened your faith. But there is more which is still to come. Trust in me, and trust in the process through which I lead you, for I am strengthening you. I'm giving you greater and greater faith. The challenges that you face are not challenges in the way that you perceive them. They are opportunities for growth, opportunities to step out in faith in a new way. Watch and see, for I am the God who uses everything, the God who wastes nothing. I am strengthening your faith this day, strengthening you so that you will be victorious, so that you truly will overcome. I see a tree in the middle of the winter. It seems lifeless. It seems dead. There seems to be no hope of it living again. But then the spring comes and all is changed. The spring comes and all is transformed. The Lord says to you, I am the God of the resurrection, the God of new life, of new hope. Do not look at how hopeless situations appear. Do not look at how things seem, but look to me and know that I am in control. Know that I am the one who is making all things new. Know that I am the one who is bringing healing, bringing wholeness, bringing fullness of life. I see you standing in a station, waiting for your train. Many trains come come into the station, even trains to your destination. And yet the Lord says, wait, don't go yet. You wait longer with the trains coming and going. And then finally, the Lord says, now, this is the one. And you board the train, wondering why it has taken so long, wondering why things were not quicker. But then as the train leaves, you realize that this train is different. It is an express train, and it goes so quick. It flies past the other trains, goes so much quicker, and arrives before any of them. The Lord says to you, I'm putting you on the express train. I'm bringing results, quick results. Do not be afraid, but trust in me, and trust in my timing, for my timing is perfect. I'm the one who brings all things together, the one who fills you with my love, the one who fills you with my perfect peace. I see the blossoms of the springtime, and the Lord says, I'm bringing forth that which is new. I'm bringing forth that which will surprise you, that which will amaze you. Do not fear, do not be afraid, but trust in me, and trust that as surely as the spring follows the winter, my blessings and my promises will come forth. I am with you, and I'm filling you with life. I'm filling you with the blessings of heaven. Open up and receive this day. Open up and receive my love in you. For I am at work. I'm at work in you. I'm the one who makes all things new. 
I hear the cry of the Lord as he walks in the garden looking for Adam and Eve. Where are you? Where are you? The Lord says to you, I love you. I truly love you and I miss you. I miss spending time with you. I miss being close to you. You are my heart's desire. You're the one that I love, the one that I want to hold close. Do not run away in fear. Do not run away in shame, but draw near to me, knowing that I love you, knowing that I forgive you, that I wash you whiter than snow. I am the one who gave up everything for you. There is no reason to run away in shame or fear. Draw near to me. Draw near to my heart. Receive my love. Receive my forgiveness. For I will make you whole. I will make you complete. Draw near to me this day. Draw near and receive my forgiveness. Receive my love. I see a fern as it unfolds. And as it unfolds, the different shapes are repeated again and again. The Lord says to you, that which I have started in the small, I will continue and I will do in the large. For I am causing an unfolding in your life, a revealing of my glory, a revealing of my goodness. I am the one who builds layer by layer, step by step. That which I start small in your life will build. And as you are faithful in the small, more will come. For the faithfulness that you show in one season of life will unfold the next season for you. Trust in me and trust in my ability to lead you forward. Trust in my ability to complete all that I have begun. Would you like a personal prophetic word? Check out the website in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe to get your daily word of encouragement. And whilst you're here, why not have a look at some other of the videos that I've made? God bless you, and have a really great day.